each neshama. Rabbi Gamliel Rabinovich, big tzaddik in Eretz Yisrael. He told this to me personally, and I just saw recently, he did a video, he repeated it. He said his father survived the war alone. When his father passed away, he had 1,000 offspring. Can you imagine splitting up that Yerusha? 1,000 offspring. He told me, Avi, when you deal with a neshama, you're dealing not with one. You're dealing with a toizente. You're dealing with a thousand. When you go ahead and you're makarev and you're loving and you bring them closer, you're bringing a thousand offspring closer. When you say, what are you doing here? Get out of here. Don't dress like this. Get out of shul. Get out of there. Get out of there. Like it happens all the time out there. You're pushing away not one Jew. You're pushing away a thousand Jews. When we're kind, their friends are going to walk into your house. Panam chadash is All of a sudden, he's going to bring his friends. And it's going to be hard for you. And embarrassing. And he's going to bring boys and girls. And girls and boys. And you're going to see neshamas and neshamas and neshamas and neshamas. I don't see the outside. I don't see the tattoos. I don't see the natsnias. I see neshamas that have grandparents in Shemayim that are crying. Please save my kid. They have parents, they have grandparents that are saying, please, and they have Hashem, their father, saying, please save them.